off. Gabriela Sabatini, Sanchez Vicario will be there. It is a terrific event there on a very, very beautiful East Coast Island. I so know you want to be with us. Sampras and Courier, as I said, 5 4 Sampras with the lead, but Courier serving. Just a snap of the wrist because he had nothing over there. There is no body right. There is no. He was totally wrong footed on that shot. This is transition tennis again. Courier goes back to the forehand. One of the very few occasions. Look at that. The snap of the wrist and he gets it over inside that service line area. Great balance. Forty love. Sampras. Sampras leads five to four. Love thirty. It's just a stunning backhand. The sort of backhand that you expect to see from Stefan Edberg. A knife straight through the ball. Dozadil coming in, trying to go for the old surprise into the net. Sampras equal to it. Three break points then.
Thirty fifteen. to do this slam duck and realize he didn't have to but still a little hot yes really no reason as we look back to the uh, attempt at slam dunk i think the first of those uh, sort of half slam dunk that we've seen this week a characteristic sampras trademark It's the one thing he does, really, as far as uh, showmanship is concerned. <laughs> but he does it dramatically well. Yes, if ever there were a man for the high jump, it would be Sampras. Oh, yes. <laughs> Changed his mind at the last moment, and the crowd are glad he did. Flick it. <laughs> what beautiful. What a hurdler he would have made. Along with Graf, I think the pick of the athletes. He's number 13. Suddenly he's very near the finishing post. 4-1 Doro per team per team Elman ma insomma questo non è il team Elman che eravamo abituati a vedere quest'anno aggredisce Sampras aiutato dal nastro inventa comunque un gran colpo questo è un colpo difficilissimo perché il nastro aveva cambiato improvvisamente la traiettoria e ha dovuto giocare una volée alta di rovescio in, eh, e ha dovuto ritrovare la coordinazione in una frazione di secondo Noto stiamo assistendo al massacro di Tim Enman 0-40, 3 palle break, 3 palle per il terzo break e il 5-0 nel set nemmeno un quarto d'ora di gioco oh! Enman è completamente spaisato completamente in stato confusionale di fronte a un Sampras che ha cominciato con una cattiveria davvero inusitata Non abbiamo, non abbiamo più parole, break a zero per Pete Sampras, 5 a 0 per l'americano, davvero impressionante, 20 punti a 5, La, le statistiche ci aiutano fino a un certo Sampras leads two games to one, fourth set. Federer leads two sets to one. Well, it made for a wonderful point, but so I would imagine Federer is saying, why didn't I go down the line on that last point? Yes, because Sampras was sitting on the cross court. He had no intention of covering it down the line. You can see Federer, no doubt, thought that, look at where Sampras was standing. Federer no doubt thought that Sampras was trying to lure him into hitting it down the line. Yeah. Well, no one makes tennis look easier than Pete Sampras when he does this sort of thing, a lovely fluent half volley. Even bothering to put the top spin on, you normally should put on a half volley. Three games on.
Uh, very much more a clay court speciality, the drop shot. Again, the Sanfras backhand down the line, and well, the frustration beginning to show. Well, he tried serve volleying at uh, 40 love earlier on. This may be too big a point for him to do it on, not being uh, that much in practice at it. Sampras, terrific stuff. Well, even though he knows that the Sampras curtain uh, backhand is firing a lot better than the forehand, coming in with this uh, finely struck shot and a beautiful bit of wrong footing, not hitting the ball with too much power, seeing that curtain with his long legs is going to be making his move to his right and just laying the wrist back here and tapping it. Nothing more, just a gentle bit of woodpecking. Serving for the opening set at 5-1. Gesture on his part. I've never seen his forehand better, you know. That, that one, sorry, Pam, that one, it looked like he really froze Agassi on the baseline. He, you know, we, we've seen him take that forehand up the line for several winners today, and he kind of held onto that one and then hit his favorite one, the cross-court one. His volleying was magnificent against Agassi. That was right up there. That was a good return. It's hard and low, and it's away. And Sampras just reaches out and pretty much steers it cross court for a winner. I mean, he's got to be in the zone to play that volley. Separate. 
Cabras leads five games to one. Video. This, this, these are the kind of shots off the ground that we're used to seeing Agassi play. He holds that. We know he can go cross court. But he disguises it so well. It's the big topspin lob. Is Most satisfying shot in tennis to me then. Is there a shot he doesn't have? <laughs> we haven't seen it. Break point. Another oh! long and it's a winner as well. And Sampras has the break. First break of the third set, two games to left. A lot of times, if there is one shot a player won't have, it is a topspin, one-handed, backhand lob. So here we go. Does he have this shot, do you think? <laughs> I would say so. Boy, he makes that look so easy. If only, you know, if only that, that is such a tough shot to play. Two games to love, Sampras. He just lets the racket here drop way below the level of the ball, brushes up over it, and all he needs. Just take a look at this uh, and how he does it. You see, he turns the shoulders full. The racket is high now, but then he lets it drop way below the level of the ball right there and then brushes up and through it and finishes high. That's how he gets the top spin. Attenzione perché se gli batte a destra Sampras se lo può ingoiare con un solo boccone. Infatti batte centrale, rovescio di Sampras. Beh. Scusami Angelo, ma io allora. applaudo a questo match point di Pete Sampras che con una, con una facilità irrisoria si sbarazza in 57 minuti di Tim Enman. 6-0, 6-3, davvero un caporetto per l'inglese. Beh, dobbiamo cercare di fare una cassetta di questo match e distribuirlo a tutte le scuole tennis perché è così che si gioca a tennis con grande sicurezza, grande fluidità ha reso i colpi più difficili che si possano interpretare nel tennis con una disinvoltura che riesce solamente ai veri fuori classe e un Sampras che se c'erano dei dubbi circa il suo stato di forma dopo la sua sconfitta contro Ferreira Basilea li ha cancellati tutti riducendo ai minimi termini quello che è considerato il giocatore più in forma del momento un Tin Enman che non può nemmeno rimproverarsi niente tanto è stata la superiorità del numero uno del tennis mondiale un minuto ancora per qualche 
dato statistico ci sono state 10 ace di Sampras 3 di Edman, quelle di Edman tutte nel secondo set 2 doppi falli di Sampras 4 di Edman 5 break a 0 in favore di Sampras che ha ottenuto 58 punti contro 32 25 And that is a brilliant little drop volley. He had to stretch Leaf. Didn't expect to hit that shot. Well, we are just being treated to some amazing tennis. Look at this approach shot. A nice chip deep. He's really stretched out. And look at how he opens up the racket face on the full stretch and just carves it. A little bit of backspin on the ball. That was a brilliant shot from Sampras. There's a strange... You don't see that very often. Most players will take the ball if they don't like the toss. At that time, Sampras was moving his weight into the ball. 